and then also Lindsay Murdoch. And Lindsay, would you please stand? These three individuals. <laughs> From the solar panels above our roof, right here with Blake, to an office of sustainability for Blake, Kia for all your tireless work, the Voice Center, Lindsay bringing the wonderful speakers to our campus, and Lily Ledbetter. Thank you for your extraordinary work on our campus and our own community. I've never seen anything like this. Three in a row. We're incredibly proud of you. Thank you. Thank you.
genuine part of yourselves and do what is right for yourself. And I think I think that will that will allow you to wake up every morning with a passion for life. And I don't know that there's anything else you can want in life. The other quote deals with balance, which is what I really believe is the key to life. Um, I, I know that this crew of people with all of these great accomplishments already will be successful in your future lives, in your professional lives, that is. Um, but it's long been known that there's a lot more to life than just professional success. And, and this quote that, I, that I've, I have here, um, some of you might recognize from convocation a few years ago. Uh, and it's from the great environmentalist Edward Abbey. And this is, his, this is in a speech that he gave over in Missoula. And it was about land conservation, but you can apply it to whatever it is that you're passionate about. So here it is. One final paragraph of advice. Do not burn yourselves out. Be as I am, a reluctant enthusiast, a part-time crusader, a half-hearted fanatic. Save the other half of yourselves and your lives for pleasure and adventure. It is not enough to fight for the land. It is even more important to enjoy it while you can, while it's still here. So get out there and hunt and fish, mess around with your friends, ramble out yonder and explore the forests, encounter the grizz, climb the mountains, run the rivers, Breathe deep of that yet sweet and lucid air. Sit quietly for a while and contemplate the precious stillness, the lovely and mysterious and awesome space. Enjoy yourselves. Keep your brain in your head and your head firmly attached to the body, the body active and alive. And I promise you this much. I promise you this one sweet victory over our enemies, over those desk-bound men and women with their hearts in a safe deposit box and their eyes hypnotized by desk calculators. I promise you this, you will outlive the bastards. <laughs> Thank you.